ASEAN FORUM FOR HUMAN RIGHTS AND DEVELOPED TIENE LA PALABRA. Mr. President, Forum Asia shares the concerns of the Special Rapporteur and Human Rights Defenders over rising threats to safety and security of HRDs and restrictions on their work. In Cambodia, the Ad Hoc Five, Ni Sok Ha, Yi Sok San, Ne Vanda, Lim Moni, and Ni Chakria have been on arbitrary pretrial detention for over 10 months on trumped-up charges. The judicial harassment of land rights defender Tep Vani continues. In Thailand, the military government uses draconian criminal provisions to silence HRDs and government critics. Student democracy activist Pai Jadupat was arbitrarily arrested and remains in detention, charged with violating less majesty provisions. In South Korea, the criminal conviction of labor rights activist Sang Yun Han had a chilling effect on peaceful activism. In Malaysia, exceptionally applied censorship laws have been used to target WHRD Lena Hendry. We call on all governments to repeal or review repressive laws used to criminalize the legitimate work of HRDs. The Special Rapporteur on Freedom of Religion or Belief reported an increase in attacks and hate crimes by state and non-state actors. Several countries in Asia criminalize or restrict legitimate expression on the pretext of blasphemy, religious hate speech, or insult to religion and religious sensitivities. Attacks against secular bloggers, online activists, journalists, and LGBTI activists in Bangladesh, and disappearances of secular activists and dissidents in Pakistan show the gravity of these threats. Impunity for these crimes emboldens perpetrators. We call on governments to repeal blasphemy laws, review legislation that restricts fundamental freedoms on the pretext of religion, and ensure transparent investigations of religious hate crimes and hold perpetrators to account.